YouTube another video and this time I'm going to talk about comparators. It's going to be short and simple, there's not a lot to say about them, but still um, requires a little bit of information uh, just to know how these chips uh, work. So uh, first of all, let's see what we have on the breadboard. We have two 4-bit uh, magnitude comparators, 7, 4, 8, 5. Here we have two 8-bit dip switches, which represents our inputs, A and B. And here we have three LEDs, which represent the outputs. And you can see that this one will go high if A is larger than B. And this one is already high, and that means that A is equals B. And that's because we have zeros on both inputs right now. And this one will go high when A is uh, smaller than B. So um, again, not a lot to say about it. So I'm going to show some examples here on how this uh, works. For example, right now we can see that A equals B and that's because we have zeros on both inputs. So I'm going to set A to 1 and we can already see that right now it, the output is A is larger than B and if I set B to 1 as well then we're back to A equals B and if I set B um, to 3, so raising the second uh, bit, then uh, we can see that A is um, smaller than B and that goes for all values, so um, again A is larger than B and if I set this to high then uh, A is smaller than B and that's how you work with it. It's um, pretty, um, pretty simple but um, in the next week I'm going to upload another video showing how to make a nice uh, game out of these comparators. Uh, pretty pretty nice and easy but that's it as I said uh, short and simple um, I hope you like this video and my explanations and I hope that you like the rest of the videos on the channel and if you like my channel please consider subscribing to it and that's it I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching